Hi guys, welcome to Cartex. I'm in a uh, new Enyaq 85. So the new motor, new battery pack for the Enyaq and also new software in the infotainment. So let's have a short look of that. Well guys, this is the new infotainment layout. Sort of different from the old one. So you haven't got a menu button over here. You need to push that button to get in the uh, normal menu, which we are used to. This is sort of apps menu. Say hello to Laura. It's the new uh, AI based uh, Lingotronic. So they say it works better. They haven't got any uh, problems with it, but yeah, let's see that. Also new, the small buttons above here. So you can uh, change them. On this card, it's the header display, uh, climatronic, etc. And you can press and hold it to change the layout of the buttons above. And the buttons on the underside are for the radio, telephone, your Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. So that's different too. Layout is a bit different too. You can press for the seat heating over here. It looks a bit different compared to the uh, old models. And this is the normal menu, some new tiles. And um, under the setup, you can find the info button, system information. And this car has software 3342. So can't find anything online, but I think it's 3.7 um, as in the ID model. So the new software, new layout, also a new computer on the back, so new hardware to make it uh, a lot quicker than the old cars. And I think you can see that it's a lot quicker. A little different layout on the buttons too. Some little graphic uh, points which have changed. So the mode button. A new layout on the button etc the normal buttons are a bit the same also the climatronic looks different than the old one it looks yeah works more easy i think well guys um i got something to tell you this isn't 3.7 as said just um i came to this conclusion You've got the pre-conditioning function, so it's 4.0, so the same software as the ID7 has now. So uh, more stable, more updates, uh, better AI. I will put a link in the description um, of the software 4.0 review I've made, so you can find uh, all of that over there. But the pre-conditioning, you can heat the battery and it needs 20 minutes to um, yeah, use the 110 kilowatt charging and well this car is pretty empty 19 percent so with a cold battery that's uh, that's great and it will be even quicker um, because the uh, state of charge as mentioned has some influence on the uh, DC charging so again for you guys the software 3342 is the 4.0 software and of course um, the car will get the over the air software update so this is the new version it will get 4.1 etc etc um, sadly the older 3.x cars won't get this uh, 4.0 software because it has new hardware new battery new electric motor so you can't refit it in the uh, retrofit it in the old cars well old cars the cars from before well guys let's do a test if i press climate it's immediately there if i press mode immediately so no slow software functions anymore it's really quick now and it works yeah it works like a dream as it should be so guys thanks for watching again hope you learned something new about the software 4.0 as mentioned i'll put the uh, review version of the id7 software 4.0 um, in the description and please like subscribe guys for more content